to the fire one. I grabbed two. I thought you were playing a game. And you guys have... You guys set up a quick response for us, the in-between rally point to d divvy off in either direction in case you either side needs assistance. Okay, that's awesome. I think probably amongst the best people for hey, this would be the Farseers. Davis is Farseers. Hey, look at hey, oh, you're back hey, on the screen. Hey, you're so tan, you don't really want to get a hand. I don't know if I was actually good. You know how uh, I'm really white? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna make myself dark. I'll mute him. Oh, I was just gonna turn it down. Nah, I muted him. I will unmute him. This was the wrong motion. Someone at him to mute his mic as I continue the story. You guys go inland. Yep, I keep checking. You guys go inland to where you guys approximate the Temple of Lightning is. You guys do run into a group which help heavily expediates this. They don't really have a name. Raze, you have met them before. Yeah? Yes. They are... The... There are a lot of things. Amidst their company is... Natives? of the Jagged Expanse, as well as survivors by luck, by chance, by circumstance of the Night of Tempest. These are provincials. They're colonists. They are a literal ranger faction in all yeah. senses of that. They are druidic. They do use guns. They make their own gunpowder. They have mystical bullets that they esoterically enchant and carve engravings and incantations into. These are rangers through and through. This would probably when be a time where Ori, you have another episode of violent cognitive dis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I imagine. What you remember when you were being trained very, s not the same, but relatively similar methods of survival survivalist techniques of being self-sufficient and stuff like that you remember learning that when you were younger in a desert place as well as here in the jagged expanse and you know in your heart of hearts that time had passed in between but in both visions in both flashbacks you have your family looks the same Uh, like just just the the parents kind of thing, or like the whole, the whole house, the whole shebang, the whole shebang. You know, in your heart of hearts, that a lot of time had passed, decades. Oh, okay, okay, I get you, I get you. But you all look the same. Mhm. Mm yeah. But like, hmm, suspicious. <laughs> The Rangers have had people that left the traders in their company. They know how to get rid of the mark. You clearly don't have the mark on you, but one of their, I guess you would call them an alas, their shamans, their sages, their druid, remarks that he can get you back your memory, but he doesn't know if you want to get them back. Considering how far along we are, she'd probably be wanting to know a bit now that she's mapped her aunt and everything, and she's got a bit more backstory, I guess. If you want, yeah. She may be a bit more willing compared to, okay. like, earlier okay. on. Alright. You greenlight the ritual, and he does it too. And you mm. remember everything. You are old. You have been around for a long time, but your middling years of life are very great. They're steeped in education that is now lost to you, that you regain now. This is where I don't know how I was going to do it. I had two uh, two main ideas in mind, where either you would just get a bunch of skills and features 
or you would actually just gain a bunch of levels. Oh, that'd be pretty cool. <laughs> you would have gotten them in the Ranger class as either the Monster Slayer subclass or the Hunter subclass, one or the other. That's pretty All cool. Right. Yeah. Hunter's better. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but nonetheless. Actually, with your build specifically, Monster Slayer would actually potentially be better. Maybe. Well, it's Monster Slayer's narratively better because you come from a noble house of Monster Slayers, don't you? Ew. You remember it all. You remember <laughs> that you're basically time static as a trader. A time static which you no longer have, might I add. But it's not like your early or your long years have, are catching up to you now. It's more of a, it's just that it was stopped. You're free of it now. You remember something, a, very, a family trend particularly in regards to how you your life was at home versus how you were in public. Your training was brutal. More so than anyone else. Because your training didn't stop when you left the training yard. Your parents were obsessed with making you the very best. The best in the line, best in the heritage, best in the lineage. Damos's words ring true when he says there were times where you can just get away with stuff as a trader despite being connected to a neural network. Looking back, you're not sure if your parents were getting away with it, more over that they were just allowed to do it. They would take you out of the walls. They'd bring you into the forests of the jagged expanse, the jungles. You would learn or you would die. I guess to their credits, you did learn. You remember the harsh criticisms, if you can call them that. This ongoing pursuit of perfection that they were trying to instill into you. You remember being ordered to put on a happy face when it came to walking around the town, particularly with your aunt. You get now why your uncle had to extract you. Because that was no life they believed you would be living. Yeah. It's not this group that they tried to extract you to, but a different one. But of the same faction. Mm -hmm. These watchers of the woods. They're nomadic, as Rays could confirm. But yep. so again, so are many things in the Jagged Expanse are nomadic. They tried, he, your uncle, tried to get you to them. pride your final memories before you went dark were of him cradling you as he was fading away you remember closing your eyes and wishing to be somewhere else then you lost your memory What's her name? I uh, don't know. Curse, why don't you disclose oh. that, huh? <laughs> well, it is actually Ori, so that's a, that's a plus. Yeah, so she's right. telling the truth all the time, don't worry. Yeah, no, no, no. The, uh, the, the tag on her bag was correct. <laughs> but it wasn't but like her, short her, her, or anything. Yeah. <laughs> well, it is technically. She's got, like, quite a long name, technically. So it's, it's Ori Bashira Khalid. Is her full nice. name. That's a hell of a name. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's a good name. That's a strong name. So, Khalid is the, the family name, and then Ori Bashira is like the first and middle. There's actually That's a really, a really interesting name. thing with this, by the way. Hmm? 
So there is the Frigidans. Yes, you know them. The you know desert peninsula. They had an empire. I guess they still do have an empire. You want to know what granted your wish? To be far away. No. Too bad. You're yes. gonna know anything. Oh, oh no! I said, it was the no, pharaoh. No, sorry, no, I do not. <laughs> I would like to know though. Yes. As O can confirm, the Frajaran Empire was run by a dynasty, the Bashir Dynasty. Hey. <laughs> so when you named yourself that, I was like, oh, I know exactly what I'm doing. It's fate. <laughs> you actually are a descendant, of, a distant descendant, albeit, of that dynasty. <laughs> So like how hey, hey, China hey, is related hey, hey. to uh, Atola Hun. Hmm? What's that, sorry? So sort of like how 90% of China is related to Atola Hun. Oh, yep, yep. Except we don't talk about that. Yeah, we don't talk about that. <laughs> no, 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 no. Of course not. You don't know when or how or who or what it's a mystery in and of itself but the guy the druid who is re like bringing back these memories does say there's some sort of magic that is that was causing your memory loss one that wasn't necessarily tied to the traders it's genie magic da, da, da. and it's also tied to your genealogy Oh, <laughs> <hush>. <laughs> well, <huh? laughs> that is a legend amongst Fajarans that the Bashir dynasty had genes. Genies, Afridi in particular, at their disposal. Oh, better hop on to Ancestry.com. Yeah. So. <laughs> congratulations. Oh, I remember. Yeah, but. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh. If you need to hop off, I don't blame you. I would say the yeah. next bit is pertinent to you, but it's up to you. Okay, uh, I can be in text. Okay. All right, take it easy, y'all. Yeah, yep. yep. Peace. I will. I've been pertinent to 